Hello and welcome to another exciting edition of Industrial Valco University where you can get your PVF degree for absolutely free. Before we start, we actually have a new sponsor, uh, Speedability Soda. Um, do you like your items in stock with air-free shipment or will call in two hours or less? Well, now you can have all of that in liquid form with Speedability Soda. Okay, we're gonna talk about traps and caps, but before we talk about these caps and these plugs, we have a, did you know? Industrial Valco University presents, did you know? To prevent the flow of air or gas, you can use a trap like you find in plumbing. Did you know? This is how the pipes underneath your sink for the garbage disposal work. Did you know that? Well, I think you did. And actually it's done in that case with a 180 return bin and a 90. And there you go. A little plumbing right there for you, but we are not a plumbing house. We are an industrial house. And because of that, we like to talk industrial things. So today we're going to talk about the difference between a cap and a plug. Two ways to stop the flow is with a cap or plug. Commonly, a cap is a female fitting, meaning that the pipe will go into it whether it be a threaded or a socket weld fitting. This will be a female fitting in plumbing or forged steel applications. However, in a weld situation of industrial pipe, it will be welded right here at the end. Well, that's a little bit about caps. Let's now talk about plugs. Plugs will be used to close pipe with a female openings. And there's really three types of plugs that we use in the industrial world. The most common are the hex head plug, the round plug, and the square head plug. Again, the hex head, the round, and the square head. Okay, so caps and plugs are both specified by the types of pipe they need to close. So for example, if you have a two inch pipe and you want to close it with a two inch cap. So we can go show you on a little overhead how that works again. There you go, two inch. This is a butt welded end, as you can see right there. Two inch cap, two inch pipe. So if you wanted to do a two inch threaded pipe and a two inch threaded cap, then again, they butt up together and we'll give you an overhead of this bad boy. There you go. That works for socket weld, for butt weld, and of course, for threaded. Pretty simple stuff. So, to review, a trap is used to close off the gas or sewage while allowing it to go in the opposite direction, like underneath your sink. However, caps and plugs are used to completely stop the flow of a pipe. Caps are used for male ends with their female threads, and plugs are used on female pipe endings with their male threaded ends. The most common carbon steel plugs are A105. The styles are hex head, round, and square head. Caps come in A105, WPB, and high yield. They come in quarter inch to 36 inch range. Okay, so there you have it. You've learned everything you need to know about traps, caps, and plugs. We do have a few moments, so I did want to take some of our viewer mail that you've been sending questions in. So I will uh, read those now and we'll kind of see what we've got. Okay, question number one. Uh, once, recently I was watching the movie Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. I noticed how much you look like Brad Pitt. Are you Brad Pitt? That is from first initial A. Joe Lee. Um, to answer the question, uh, no, I am not Brad Pitt. And I don't think I look like Brad Pitt but I do think that Brad Pitt looks like me. All right, second question. This says, Professor Jim, love the show. You are brilliant, thank you. Um, question is, where can I buy all of this stuff that you promote? 25,000 line items, I would love to have it all from JQ Public. Well, that's an easy one. You can buy it all right here at ivalco.com. 25,000 line items ready for you to get in there and have it all. All right, I hope you learned something today um, about traps, caps, and plugs, and we'll talk to you soon. Have a great day.
Hey everyone, thanks again for watching. Be sure to click the subscribe button so you do not miss a class. Also, be sure to go to ivalco.com where you can get more information and resources for the items that you saw and also have the opportunity to purchase these items with our 24 seven online ordering. Also be sure to visit our partners at the American Supply Association or ASA.net for additional training and courses that are tailored for all areas of the supply chain management.